Oh. Master Casimir, toss aside the torch, you guards. Ah! Piss off, then! Fuck off! You'll not tell me what to do! What? What's going on here? In deep play, Master Casimir sat upon his roof. Claims he'll blow himself to bits. Bought the wench pearls, silks, satins, and how the fuck she repaid me? Made me a heat banger cuckold! Huh. A falling out in the family? Aye. His Euphemia. She were fine. Pretty as a picture, you might say. And five bairns they has. On the short side, but so well mannered. Always bow, ask after your health. Not at all grumpy like the Elderman's laddies. Till the day Euphemia bundled up her belongings and their bairns, tossed them all on a wagon, and that's all we've seen of her. Master Chasm has been pure yumpy since. Balling, whinging, now this. Ah, this'll be one for the ploughing annals. Going out with a bang. When this fucking blows, they'll see the fires in Novigrad. I'll try to talk some sense into him. But if he should grow angered... The wench demanded a canopied bed and got it. Silver tableware, she said. Got that too. Lacking nothing. Not a thing. What the fuck else was I to give her? Doubt he can grow any angrier. Hail, my little, our hallowed mother. Keep us from evil. What kind of knob you got? Lightly come to poke my Euphemia, eh? Well, you're late. She's gone. No, I just... Postmaster said the same. Denied it all. Swore on the balls of his gods. And the Egypt I am, I believe the bugger. Three years they bumped about under my nose. Then ran off. My granda told it right. Not a bloke out there doesn't want to get between a dwarf wench's trotters. Care to set that torch aside so we can talk this out calmly? 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 Wench tossed me aside, took the wains, and I'm to be calm! The country, she says. Fresh air's what I need, she says. So we came out here. Anything for my bunny! Sets that is sucking air. She sucked off the postmaster in my plowing bed. I can't take it no more! Forget about it. Listen, got a job for you. <coughs> for, forget it! Here I am, bearing my soul. And you're gonna talk me up about what? You're all the same! We dwarves, we're born to muck about in the mind. <laughs> Bend our necks, the human yokes. You didn't get a duck's cock about it, you plurin' racists! Come to think of it, doubt you're fit for the job. Not in that state. What? I'm not fit? What the fuck are you saying I'm not fit for, you cocksucker? I'd need you to blow something up, open. But... And I'm not fit for that. Me, Casimir Bassi, top mind foreman in Mahakam. More like top cuckold in Redania now. Top? <laughs> what? You wait. You car. You rogue. You dickhead. You just wait. Splinter them! Oh. Oh. Sorry. Would have preferred to talk it out. Thing is, you gave me no choice. Nay, then he apologized. I needed something of the sort. Some fella to knock the muck out of my heat. Oh. So, uh. What is it you wanted? Want you to open a door. Permanently. So it won't close again. I see. And what might you find on the other side of this door? A reward. Big one. To be split. Enough for everyone. 
If it come a week past, I'd have sent you the fuck away. But now, now I've nothing to lose. What's it I'm to do? I'll let you know. What? I was a minge here from taking my life. Now you give me the patter of a wench from personnel at manufactory. Didn't he call on us? We'll call on you. Are you pure mad dafty? Now talk, and didn't you swipe me? Are you giving me the job or not? Know what? Changed my mind. Think we'll both be better off. I'm no use to a witcher either. Ah! <laughs> Shite luck, that. Shite life. Damn it. 